Hi, I'm Donald with Steambrite Supply, and today we're going to talk about the Goliath pressure washing recycler. Now, this unit is not a pressure washer, but rather the vacuum recovery unit that you would make with a pressure washing system that you would already own. And you'll notice, first of all, it doesn't have any wheels. This is something that typically you would bolt to the floor of your service vehicle or trailer. Uh, it does have a 27 gallon vacuum recovery tank and is auto pump out. Now this particular unit is something that can operate on either one or two power cords and the reason for that is that it basically has two systems under the hood. Uh, under the hood you'll see two large vac motors and two pump out pumps. Now the way that you can operate this unit depending on the amount of electricity you have you can either operate it with one power cord generating 138 inches of water lift at 140 uh, cubic feet of airflow per minute or you can double that to 275 cubic feet of airflow per minute and if you're running both power cords with both vac motors and both water pumps you can actually operate this unit at 150 feet of vacuum hose. Now on the front of the unit it has a two inch barb connection which means you can operate either two inch vacuum hose or inch and a half vacuum hose. The uh, pump out system, each pump on the inside under the hood will push out 3.3 gallons a minute and so the, the combined unit if you're running both power cords is going to be able to discharge 6.6 .6 gallons a minute. Now since most pressure washers actually use less than that, this will work fine for most of those applications. Now, the way this is set up is you'll have a, its own independent cord for each vac motor and each pump out. Uh, there is actually a check valve system. If you look under the, kind of in the waste tank here, um, down here in the bottom, down here on this side, that's actually a vacuum check valve and allows you to, if you're only going to run it on half or one vac motor with one pump out, you don't have to do anything because it's actually going to shut off the vac motor that is not in use so that it works fine. You don't have to open it up and disengage the vacuum system. You just run the one power cord and it's good to go. Uh, you'll also notice under the hood we have a lint filtration system to catch some of the trash as well as each pump out system has a secondary screen. Now on the back of the unit you'll see the garden hose discharge as well as there's a lift handle both on the rear and the front. Uh, also on the back of the unit uh, these are 25 foot 12 3 extension cords and they each have their own circuit breaker as well as a circuit locator system. Now the circuit locator system uh, will allow you to tell you that you're on separate breakers or phases. So if you're going to use it as a two corded system it's really easy to find out that you're not going to trip the circuit breaker because that will light up for you when you plug it in correctly. Now one of the other things that we're going to give you with this unit is a mighty F200 hose mount lit filter. Now this is actually going to go between two sections of vacuum hose. So if I had, let's say, 100 feet to my surface cleaner or my tile and grout cleaning wand, it's going to come into this filter and then the, the filtered water then gets picked up and maybe you might have five or six feet going to your Goliath. And I'll open this up and show you how it's built on the inside. So it's got a, a lift out system here to catch all the rocks, sticks, leaves, stems, anything that's uh, larger than about a 3 16 hole is going to stay in this aluminum filter. This company does also provide some nylon uh, inserts, so if you want really fine filtration, you can actually put the, the nylon bag on the inside and tuck it around here and then put it back in, and this offers some additional filtration. Now we're going to offer this Goliath in two different versions. We're going to have it available like you see it here and it's going to filter the water with these filters that are provided. We're also going to offer it with two large 20 inch by 1 inch pipe thread connections uh, water filtration system and it's going to have uh, a 20 micron as well as a 5 micron filtration system. Now these pumps push at 60 psi so uh, at 6.6 .6 gallons a minute it 
uh, 60 psi is enough water pressure to be able to push through those large filters and that means the water that's being discharged can actually be down to 5 microns so if you want to push it back into your fresh water tank on your pressure washer you can recycle the same water over and over again. Now the filters that we're going to put on those are going to be washable so just like this one you can rinse off and these you can rinse off. These all come apart. You can all rinse all of them. The two that we're going to put on the side of this unit is an additional filtration system. will be rinsable, washable filters so you can reuse them over and over. Anyway, thanks for watching.